So this right here is why you can't land the right hand, right? Important concept to understand when it comes to boxing, right? Street boxing, Coach Brody, this is Antonio right here. So this is what we're doing, right? Now something to understand is that everything in boxing, a lot of things are about positioning, positioning, foot positioning. What you need to understand is that when it comes to boxing, right? This is a very safe position to be in, right here. Boom, because you can throw your jabs very easily, right? Face me. Now look at where my feet are. I'm here. Boom, I can just throw the jab, split the jab very easy, right? But unless the pathway from the inside of where your foot is, the, like the inset, the inside of the foot, if the inside of this foot doesn't have a clear pathway to your opponent, it's going to be very difficult for you to land the right hand without throwing yourself off balance. That doesn't mean you leave it open to the in-person the entire time, right? But let's say I'm jabbing him. I'm jabbing him. I sneak the foot over. Once this foot is snuck over, then I can throw the right hand, right? I, then I can just throw the right hand. But as long as this foot is in the way, it's going to be difficult for me to land it, right? And I'm talking about like a straight right hand. Now, this isn't the only way to get there. You can do it through moving this foot over, or if you're here, making a slight pivot this way, now I'm open to landing my right hand, but he can't hit me with his, right? So, let's work, over here, it's going to jab, pair of jabs. Now, what you need to do is stay in a position where you're safe, mm -hmm. so have yourself laid it off, right? Then sneak your foot over. Sneak your foot over first. So you sneak it over, is while you're throwing the jab, you don't even have to throw it hard. You stick it out, right? When I stick out the jab, now you can throw the right hand. All right? Right? Boom, perfect, perfect. 